Hey, what's up everyone? We're back with another Cranky Films video and we're going to be reacting to How many pressure washers does it take to fly? But I did a thing. Uh -huh. So we're going to see how this guy could fly or if it just flops and fails. Well, let's get right into it. He, he doesn't fail. He, he doesn't stop until... He doesn't stop until injury happens. <laughs> no, his, well, his channel's not, I, I'm, I'm attempting a thing, my guy. It's, I did a thing. I'm right. So let's go to get straight well, into it. 16 minutes, 21 all seconds. All right then. How are you going? If you've ever used a pressure washer, you've probably had the same thought as me. You turn it on and you feel the power and the speed of the water running through your hands. And that makes yeah. you think, what would happen if I put this in my up? <laughs> oh, no, that's gonna... And then, that, that, that'll hurt. You probably wanna know how many pressure washers it would take to get you in the air. So today, I'm gonna find out. I don't know if it's that many, to be honest. Okay, when you search online, you find a bunch mm. of fake videos of people flying. Like this one by Zach King. There's a water power jet pack. Or this one by oh, these yeah. two goofy guys just mucking around during work. With these two pressure washers <laughs> conveniently <laughs> faced real, perfectly towards the camera. And surely, if it was this easy, every tradie in Australia would be flying to work. Terrible. <laughs> so I took apart my pressure washer bidet and pointed the pressure washer oh. down at this scale to see how no much force. Way. I have to watch that. that. I have to watch that. Days, one, my man. weight is roughly That's between 88 and 90 kilos, depending on if okay. I do a morning poo and whether that huh. poo falls on the scale or not. And now, when I turn ah. on the washer, I weigh 1.5 kilos less, which means That's that cool. unless those goofy men weighed three kilos, the <laughs> video is fake. And this is way less power than I was hoping for, and means I would need 80 of these cheapo pressure washers strapped to every God part of my damn. body to cancel out my weight, which would cost me $16,000 and is yeah. not going to happen. Yeah. So I need right. to find a stronger power washer. And I don't really understand the physics of this, <laughs> yeah, but I think that evil. if I weigh 90 God. kilos, I essentially need 90 kilos of upwards force every second to get my big booty off the ground. Damn! Oh my god. And it is possible Caked to do up. these with water, as there are companies that offer water jetpack experiences that work by essentially strapping their customers oh. to the exhaust of a jet ski, which gives some pretty impressive results. And jet skis have a flow rate of 4,000 litres per minute, which is heaps. Hmm. To put that in perspective, oh my, my mate Alexa my, my has a flow rate of around one and a half litres per minute. Oh. Damn! What the f- Oh my god. Just stop peeing. <laughs> Just don't stop. forget the wiggle, Compared my to guy. a normal pressure washer, which has 8 litres of flow per minute, so that means the jet ski has 500 times more water flow than a pressure washer. But using a jet ski is cheating, and I want to find a yeah. pressure washer strong enough. So I attempted to modify my existing mm. pressure washer so it gets more flow, by drilling out the nozzle and removing the filter. Oh no, that actually makes it worse. But I this broke it, smart, which this. gave me the yeah, idea of breaking it. other people's pressure washers. So I borrowed a 3000 PSI, 15 litre a minute pressure washer. Oh and even God. though I won't be able to get the same flow rate as a jet ski, I'm hoping I can get the same force by having a much higher PSI. And I got on the scale again after eating a big lunch and a bunch of fishing sinkers and now weighing oh my head, really. And this time it looks like I'm losing around three to four kilos, but it's hard to tell from all the water spray. And I really thought it would give me more lift, as it feels like it has more than four kilos of kickback. That's ripped. But maybe it's not transferring it into is. lift as I'm not holding the hose tightly against my body. That's crazy. Then I figure I might get more thrust if I take <laughs> I, off I the just nozzle, hope he doesn't hit his feet with a stupid flight. pressure washer. No. No. The nozzle now is like what Alexa. makes it pressure washer. The pressure washer needs the nozzle to build up pressure. Mm -hmm. Then I thought I might be able to make it stronger if I opened up the handle and lost these tiny screws in the grass. A rip. Oh. Which didn't help either. And looks like I'm only getting five kilos of thrust. So I'm going to need dang. more power. And I found these even stronger industrial petrol powered pressure washers. Oh my god. Which will deliver 20 litres of water a minute at 5,000 psi which might be able to get me in the air a if I have multiple of them. But before I hide them, I decided to see if my arms were even capable of supporting enough thrust to get me off the ground. So I made this pulley system, which I can add weight to, and will pull up my arms in the same direction as the pressure washers. Now, if I want to get off the ground, I need to be able to support 45 kilos of upwards force in each arm. But first, tried out the system with 20 kilos. Oh you have it on drywall. 
Now, some of you have probably noticed that I've moved house, and this wasn't my choice. And it turns out landlords don't like it when you film yourself destroying stuff and blasting holes in your ceiling. And the Jeez. new garage is nice, but doesn't have the crappy DIY feel of my old place. So I made sure to replicate some of the most recognizable features, like this blade so pan and some of the holes that my old you. place had. So let's just I hope, hope the new landlord doesn't on. watch this video. <laughs> also, lucky for Dude, me, we gotta watch more of this wild shit they so showing us. So I got a bunch of these tools from the fifties to add to my garage, like this drill press, a cool vice, a nice big tank of gas for the welder. And most excitingly, a tool I've always wanted to use. A rice cake? Oh. Child labor. Oh. We should have oh. to make things much quicker. I said child labor. Okay, so I went outside and added 40 kilos to the rope, which was okay, really hard to support. And hurt my hand heaps. And that oh. is even without the threat of being blasted open by water. So I can't imagine how hard it's going to be with the pressure washers. Yeah, goodness. But I decided to hire the four big ones anyway. And I didn't realize how hard it would be to hire this many he pressure lost washers. This cake. As most places only have one big one. And then when I finally found a place that had four, I didn't consider that I needed a cover story as to why I needed them. And then I, when I was on the phone, I panicked. And for some reason told them I needed four to clean my kitchen. So Kennard, <laughs> if you're watching, here's me doing the dishes. Wait, and even though they God. seem confused, they still delivered four giant pressure washers. Yeah, nice. Yeah, kitchen. yeah, just four of them. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, before I put them all on me, there are a couple of things I still need to do. Obviously, I can't hold four pressure washers, so I need to make some kind of brace for my arms, which will help me stabilize them, but also means I'm attached to the pressure washers, so I'm going to fly wherever they take me. And I made the brace out of this square bar, which I cut into arm-sized pieces. Oh my god, it's coming for him. I then welded on some right angle pieces for the rope to go through, and then also welded another brace on the end, which should help me hold my body weight against it in a similar way to crutches. Then I tied on the pressure washers, creating okay. this almost illegal looking device. Yeah, it does look illegal. And then illegal. comes the most important <laughs> step, which is dipping the end of the brace in the sponsor of today's video, PayPal Honey. Honey. Honey Yo. is the number one shopping oh tool God. in America, but I like to think of it as being more similar to an online sidekick inside my computer and is always trying to find me great deals on the things I'm buying. Simply, mm. Honey automatically searches for promo codes so you don't have to. And when you buy something, if Honey works on that site, it swoops in to help you Easy find a great saves. deal. It doesn't matter what you are buying, as Honey works on many of the sites you are already using. There is nice. really no reason not to use Honey. It just sits there and helps you. For example, it doesn't I was work when you don't want it to the Honey <laughs> coupon to save you only $10. Only works when you don't really need it. I find that when using like, Honey oh, for I online shopping, it bucks. really takes off a lot of the but when you pressure. don't have that much and you need something it doesn't work oh my god so go done? now and add it to your browser for free at joinhoney.com slash i did joinhoney.com slash i did a thing Okay, back to the pressure washer gun. So I put down some plywood and some mats so I don't hurt myself when I fall down. And then pulled out this old record player to use as a platform. Then because I only have one hose, I borrowed some more from my neighbor who was strangely supportive of what I was trying to do. And now I have four 5,000 pressure washers maybe. hooked up to four separate <laughs> water supplies with well, a combined then. pressure of 20,000 PSI and 80 liters per minute flow rate. 80 times more than my mate. Okay, now, before going straight to the four pressure washers, I just want to see what two feel like without an arm brace. Oh! Matt, rip his wrist. Holy sh oh, oh, God. Yeah. The bad, thing, the bad thing is, it's like getting electrocuted because when oh. it pushes up to this position, 
I can't let go of my grip. <laughs> it's pulling away. It's so hard into my hand that it's going to fly away. So I need to grip it. That's insane. That's... Yep. Fun. This one <laughs> is a million times stronger than this one. And that wasn't a good idea. But luckily the nozzles want to fly up away from my feet. Although, if they do cut them off, I will weigh less. Also, the <laughs> scales weren't displaying much more True. weight loss than the 3,000 yeah, PSI like pressure washer. Band-aids on this other big But then I realised something. These pressure washers are rated to a flow rate of 20 litres per minute, but my neighbour's garden hose only outputs 8 litres per minute. So unless these pressure washers pull out more water somehow, they aren't producing as much power as they could be. So, I got this external pump, which has a flow rate of 7,200 oh litres per hour. My man is 120 litres <laughs> per hour, and then got these old sewage way. hoses, I which were a little too small, so I used this heat said. gun to loosen them up oh, before shoving the pump into the hose's urethra. He urethra. gets the views, Which he now pump out heaps more water. He might have. And after connecting the new hoses, I tested out the braces with two pressure washers. Yeah, I figure I should test with, uh, just two? First, is considering how much one of those kicked, like... Pretty it, terrifying. It might be impossible to control. You also look like an orc. I feel like a Vietnam war guy. Which side? The flamethrowers and children. Oh, yeah, yeah, great. The losing side. At least you're on the, the correct <laughs> end of it. I'm going to be turning the stuff on over here. I'll be, like, directly down the nozzle from it. Okay. Yeah, you can turn it on. Oh. Oh my god, the recoil! Okay, these feel Good way Lord. stronger than the normal garden hoses and were pushing me back really hard two. and I couldn't really keep them four. in one spot <laughs> and oh, even yeah. allowed me to do this which doesn't look very impressive on camera but felt very cool in my head. I'm sure it did. That, that would so be fun though. all four pressure washers. But before I did that, I wanted to see what would happen to my head if the four pressure washers somehow did slip out of my hands and pointed directly at my face. Is there a oh, score yeah, on yeah. the watermelon? You're going to turn these ones on first. Yep. Yeah. You're turn them on first. Okay. And then, then you'll turn these ones I'm on. I'm turning on all of them. Huh? I'm turning all of them on. You're going to turn all of them on. And then if I want you to stop, I'll point at one and then go like this. So I go like... Your hands are... You're going to be holding these. You oh, can't. Yeah, <laughs> oh, <my God>. yeah. <laughs> that's a blunder. Yeah, I'm just... glad you told me before I tried to. <laughs> you killed <Not> me. <laughs> oh my oh, god. And the power of these four washers <laughs> together was insane. The only way to yeah. describe the feeling is kind of as if a wet man was pushing back on my underarms while spitting oh. on my face. Oh, oh my god! What the f I bet his neighbors hate the noise, dude. What? I four stupid Wait, engines. I, I wanted to eat the watermelon afterwards. There's no watermelon! Hey! <laughs> Oh. What? <laughs> well, I didn't Is it any good? I did not expect it to look like that. Dude, it's like it's turned into a milkshake as well. It's, it's like, so frothy. It's like a slushy. I go for a slushy. Mm. It's actually not that bad. Ew. It's a good way to eat watermelon. That's amazing. It tastes a bit like pool water. But <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's full of chlorine. And after a snack, I had enough confidence to continue. So with the wheelchair on standby, we were good to go, and Alexa Wheelchair. turned on all Wheelchair. four pumps. Oh my god. They didn't have a blast shield. And although I look very graceful here, it may surprise you to know <laughs> that does. I didn't really have any control of what the an movements angel. my body was making, nor could I let go of the trigger. I also couldn't scream loud enough over the pressure washers to tell Alexa to turn them off. But <laughs> man, man risking his life. You're telling me to turn it off and you're shooting at the machine that I meant to turn off. I'm like... <laughs> oh, I couldn't really control it. It's bad because you start... You start off with, like, strength. You know, but then the longer you're doing it, it's just like... I don't know, holding 15 kilos up. You can't really, really... <laughs> work out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's a workout for sure. More than a damn workout. Floppy, your arm just keeps going.
So I decided to have another go, but this time with the washers closer to my body and securely in my underarms, but also with the scale to see how much force I was getting. Oh. Wow. He gained weight. Yeah. The scale was saying I was losing about 50 kilos, going from 110 to 60-ish, which is a lot of force. That's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's, there you go. Then I decided to try jumping. Now they got a little float. A little bit. Now it doesn't really look like anything is happening, but I did feel like I was getting a little bit more air time than usual. And I'm not trying to say I was anywhere close to flying, but it did look pretty cool. He's doing it. And in the slow mo, that's so beautiful, that I dude. seem to get a bit he of extra height and fall slower than usual. Or that could just be the wobble from the pressure washers and the slow mo from the camera making it look like that. So I gave it a couple more goes, but my altitude remained pretty similar. And with these pressure washers, I was getting around 12.5 kilos each, meaning I would need eight of these to get me off the ground, plus oh the weight my. of the pressure washers, so more like 10 of these. So unless I magically lose 50 kilos, I don't think these pressure washers are going to make anyone fly today. Yeah, no way in hell. Mm. What about the kid? You reckon you can come with me? No! Oh, no! no don't, yes. no. <laughs> don't strap him up! Come with me! Come on! No! Oh, wait, wait, He's so yeah, hesitant. Yeah, yeah. Now, Dude, the kid's going to fly back! Yeah, yeah, <laughs> keep it like That's that. what I got to do, the moon. Why am I still no. tape him? At least. <laughs> Thanks. That, that's a dummy. If you like that, oh please subscribe <laughs> and check out some of my other oh videos. Oh my god. That was, a, that was about to say. That was so good, dude. Jesus. So. <laughs> my man. <bro>. So. <laughs> it's like. It didn't work, but he, he just needs more power output and more of those things, but he. That's a lot of money there. My man it, it, needs two fire trucks. The two fire. I think he needs uh, four more. Four. Yeah, yeah basically four, four more, and he he'd be able to take flight. Yeah. That's it's unwieldy just, oh though. <laughs> it's just a lot more work that needs to be done, and you have the way he was holding it. You're not gonna get. You you could get up in the air if you had more of them, but you have to secure it in a way where your arms aren't moving that much that you float up and then all of a sudden it pushes you front or back <laughs> yeah, it's just unwieldy yeah be like iron man put it on the feet and on the arms <laughs> then his legs are gonna break <laughs> true he's gonna be torn limb from limb <laughs> is that his arm no it's his leg <laughs> all right well guys that was what how many pressure washers does it take to fly and it turns out it needs a lot more than that than four but i hope you guys like please subscribe and tell us how many more you want us to watch or if you want us to watch any more from this guy well that's been the cranky films and we'll see you all next time stay cranky